Hello and welcome back. Uh, so last example we have seen the app uh, SMS app. Okay, and uh, so now in this video we will start with uh, another example that is uh, show password. Okay, I just tell you what is the example is show password. Okay, generally you have a password box, okay, and you also have some show password link, right, or some icons also will be there. So when you select the show password, so password will be visible, and when I uh, deselect, so it will be convert to password, right? So let's make that example now with Angular, okay? So first let me come in this SMS app, so it's removed. So go to components, open terminal, let's say NGGC uh, show password. We got the component and configure here show password. So you get the show password works. So let's have a design. So last example, we have taken a design, right? The, for example, this one. Okay, let's copy the same design for the card and everything so i just change this to show password okay so i got like this okay and i just need uh, not this much uh, let's say call md4 okay fine so here ready to have a form so let's take uh, a form uh, in this let's take input type is equal to text uh, not text it's a password box password and class form control okay you got a form control uh, you want to have a um, placeholder you can write a placeholder also password okay you got it and below that <coughs> I create one checkbox okay you can make icon also but we are not discuss how conditionally you display the icon so better you take a checkbox so input type is equal to uh, checkbox and class is uh, uh, for checkbox is different class input check sorry form check input and let's say show password okay so now <coughs> we got a password box and also we have show password so my plan is when i check the checkbox display the password when i uncheck i don't want to show the password okay this thing so how to do first of all tell me how can you show the password you know there is no secret to show the password the thing is depend on a input type okay we can't convert password box to text box only thing we do is type we change okay for example, see here, type I given password. So what happen is become password box. When I say password to text, I change manually. So it's become text box. So it means if it is password, it's hidden. If it is text, it is shown. So I have to change this particular type value automatically or dynamically depend on the check. Correct? Okay. But how to bind this data? If it is static text, it will be always static text only. But how to bind this dynamic? So you can you know the property binding, right? So let's create a variable here. Public input type of type string is equal to password I have taken. Okay. So input type password I have taken. And this input type I want to bind here. So how you bind? You right take the brackets and then here it will be input type. So what happened? Input type is password. So dynamically it binds password value here. So now the total input will become a password box. Okay. And if it is binded, I can change this to text. What happened automatically? It change to text box. If I change this to date, it will become a date selection. If I change this to range, will become a range selection understood okay so we just need a password by default okay so this input field I want to change 
not manually like this i want to update automatically when you check depend on this guy and moreover when you check the checkbox when i deselect the checkbox it is actually a change event on the checkbox change event so what i do is on the checkbox change event let's say update input a function so it will take a dollar event okay the the current event of it so let's copy uh not update input you can create any any proper name just say show password you take okay that looks good show password function and i create you can create anywhere <coughs> so for our understanding i just create here public this one yeah so this is taking an event of type any and this returns nothing is void okay so what is my plan is when you check display uncheck don't display so it means when you check make it password uncheck make it text so how you know that is check simple you write if condition even dot target dot checked there is something called checked property so let's take an alert you you verify it say checked okay so when you check you get the alert checked now see when i select check see i got checked okay nice but if i deselect nothing comes because nothing is there for deselect okay super so now if it is checked i want to update this guy to text how you do this dot input type is equal to the say text correct okay and one more thing if i deselect that is else else if it is not checked make this dot input type is equal to back to password okay if it is checked convert to text if not checked convert to password type so if this is the case now back here i type something when i select display something when i deselect is gone got it that way for example you type some uh, some password some like this select display otherwise gone okay looks good you can even simplify this statement if this else this or you can use the uh, ternary operator like even dot target dot checked then if that is the case you can use uh, the statement otherwise another statement that is password okay and you don't need this much story this one line is enough okay if it is checked update to text otherwise password now test you refresh and something okay perfect this how you can make the things in angular okay so that's it enough for this video and let's see uh, another example in the next video thank you